Hello everyone. I welcome all of you to the India Metallurgical Department Daily Weather Briefing. Myself, Dr. Arul Alan, scientist. As on today, 11th June 2025, let's see the past observation. The severe heat wave conditions observed over the Jammu Kashmir, Punjab, West Rajasthan, West Madhya Pradesh. The heat wave conditions observed over the Himachal Pradesh, Haryana, Chandigarh, Delhi, Uttar Pradesh, East Rajasthan, and East Madhya Pradesh. And severe warm night conditions was observed over the West Uttar Pradesh and West Rajasthan. Also warm night condition observed over the Punjab, East Uttar Pradesh and Haryana. Also the very heavy rainfall observed over Telangana, over uh, Khammam district up to 12 cm and Kerala and Meghe, Idiki district received 14 cm. Heavy rainfall observed over the Uttarakhand, Odisha, Assam, Tripura, Chhattisgarh, Tamil Nadu, Puducherry, Karakal, Coastal Andhra Pradesh and Yanam. Thunderstorm accompanied with the squally and gusty wind speed reaching up to 60 to 90 kmph observed over the Marathwada, Chhattisgarh, Andaman, Nikopar Islands, Tamil Nadu, Puducherry, Karakal. Also, the, speed, the gusty wind speed reaching up to 30 to 60 kmph observed over the Vidarbha, Madhya Pradesh, Madhya Maharashtra, Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Meghalaya, Nagaland, Manipur, Misram, Tripura, Gangetic, West Bengal, Uttar Pradesh, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Kongan, Jammu and uh, also over the Jharkhand, Bihar and Odisha. The progress of monsoon. The northern limit of monsoon continues to pass through the uh, 17 degree north, 55 degree east and 17 degree, 17.5 degree north and 60 degree east. Also the 18 degree north and 65 degree east, 18.5 degree north, 70 degree east and then followed by Mumbai, uh, Ayanagar, Adi Adiabad and uh, Bhavani Patna, Puri. Sandan Island 23.5 degree north and 89 degree 89.5 degree east and Bulgar Gorge and then for finally 30 degree north to 85 degree east. Conditions are likely to be favorable for further advancement advancement of southwest monsoon over some more parts of central and adjoining east central India ar around 14th June. Synaptic conditions an upper air cyclonic circulation lies over west central Bay of Bengal off north coastal Andhra Pradesh coast and it extends up to 5.8 km above mean sea level. Yeah. Also a trough runs from the northeast Rajasthan to the above upper air cyclonic circulation across Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh at 0.9 km above, above mean sea level. The, trough, the upper air cyclonic circulation over northeast Uttar Pradesh and neighborhood and now lies over the east Uttar Pradesh and extends up to 1.5 km above mean sea level. An upper air cyclonic circulation lies over North Haryana and Chandigarh uh, at 0.9 km above mean sea level. A fresh western disturbance as a trough in middle tropospheric westerlies with its axis at, at 5.8 km above mean sea level runs roughly along 58 degree east to the north of uh, latitude of 30 degree north and it is likely to affect over the northwest India from 13th June 2025 onwards. The highlights Monsoon likely to be in active phase with a very with a heavy to very heavy rainfall at a few places also extremely heavy rainfall at isolated places over South Peninsular India during 12th to 16th June and also over the Kongan Goa during 12th to 14th June 2025. Heat wave to severe heat wave conditions are likely to continue over Northwest India including Western Himalayan region till 13th and then reduce thereafter. The forecast of the temperature. No significant change in maximum temperature likely over northwest and central India during next three days and gradual fall by 2 to 4 degrees Celsius thereafter. No significant change in maximum temperature likely over east India during next 24 hours and gradual fall by 2 to 3 degrees Celsius thereafter for subsequent three days and no significant change thereafter. No significant change in maximum temperature likely over rest part of the country. Yesterday's maximum temperature or in the range of 43 to 47 degrees Celsius over most places of Rajasthan and few places over Madhya Pradesh and also in isolated places over Punjab, Haryana, Chandigarh, Delhi. Yesterday the highest maximum temperature was 47.6 degrees Celsius reported at Batinda or the Punjab region. The day one weather warning has been shown here in this picture. A red alert has been issued over the uh, Rajasthan and Punjab Chandigarh for the uh, severe heat wave condition also for the warm night condition and over Jammu Kashmir orange warning is issued for the severe heat wave conditions and also over the oh, Himachal Pradesh and uh, heavy rainfall warning has been issued over the Kerala uh, Kerala and coastal Karnataka and North India Karnataka South India Karnataka coastal Andhra Pradesh also over the Telangana region and yellow warning has been issued over the Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Meghalaya and Bihar for the hot and humid conditions and heat wave warning with yellow warning has been issued over the west Uttar Pradesh and um, east and west Madhya Pradesh. 
and rest of the yellow warning covers for the th thunderstorm activity with the gusty winds and this is for the day 2 weather warning has been issued for the valid for the 12th june the red warning likely to continue over the west rajasthan also over the punjab uh, haryana region for the severe heat wave condition and then warm night conditions and over jammu kashmir orange warning has been continued for the severe heat wave condition also over the himachal pradesh and extremely heavy rainfall uh, or red warning also issued over the over the coastal karnataka and then north india karnataka and south india karnataka and kongan goa region and hot and humid condition likely to uh, persist over the assam meghalaya also over the bigar bigar region with yellow warning and madhya maharashtra sorry madhya pradesh having the yellow warning with the heat wave warning also the madhya maharashtra and then chatisgarh having the uh, orange warning for the strong winds also lightning and then heavy rainfall activity the tamil nadu region also receiving the orange warning for the heavy rainfall activity and for the day 3 which is valid for the 13th june forecast red warning continues over the uh, west rajasthan for the he severe heat wave and then warm night conditions also over the punjab chandigarh region and uh, yellow warning has been issued over the jammu kashmir and himachal pradesh for the heat wave conditions and also for the red warning still continues over the uh, coastal karnataka and then kongan goa and then south inter karnataka for the extremely heavy rainfall activity and heavy rainfall activity warning has been issued over the kerala and tamil nadu and then interior maharashtra and uh, north inter karnataka also strong surface wind warning has been issued over the coastal andhra pradesh and then kerala also over the uh, coastal karnataka and the north inter karnataka and this is for the day 4 warning valid for the 14th june red warning uh, uh, still continued over the southern peninsula especially over the coastal karnataka and then uh, kongan goa region also over tamil nadu for the extremely heavy rainfall activity with the red warning has been issued and uh, heat wave conditions with the orange warning has been issued over the northwest rajasthan also over the punjab haryana delhi region and strong wind uh, warning also issued over the southern india especially over the kerala coastal karnataka and north india karnataka also over the coastal andhra pradesh and for the day 5 warning has been shown here where that heat wave condition has been reduced as we already mentioned the, due to the uh, western disturbance and however that uh, uh, red warning also issued for the uh, the southern peninsula for the extremely rainfall activity over tamil nadu and then uh, south inter karnataka and then coastal karnataka region and strong surface wind warning also been issued over the coastal karnataka and then uh, interior karnataka also over the coastal andhra pradesh and this is for the day 6 warning which is valid for the 16th june orange warning has been issued over the uh, coastal karnataka and then south inter karnataka for the uh, extremely heavy rainfall activity and uh, over tamil nadu heavy, heavy rainfall activity also been issued with a low warning and rest of the country covers for the uh, rainfall activity along with the lightning and thunderstorm activity the yellow, yellow warning has been covered and for the day 7 valid for the 17th june yellow warning has been issued for the lightning activity and thunderstorm activity wherever it is covered also heavy rainfall activity yellow warning has been issued over the tamil nadu and coastal karnataka also over the south inter karnataka stay tuned thank you